here and today I'm be showing you some cool little things in Destiny. These won't necessarily make you any better, but you can show them to your friends. And they're just cool little things that Bungie added to the game. And it's like the little things that make it cool, you know? So, uh, here they are. I'll be showing, you to showing them to you. Uh, it's two things, really. I didn't know this when I first started. I just kind of discovered them by accident. Um, so yeah, once it gets done loading. Um, a little quick review on Destiny. It's a great game. I don't know why there's so much hate on it. Like, the campaign is awesome, especially when you play it with a friend. Uh, but, I mean, like, the Crucible, or the multiplayer, is super fun. Uh, there's just a lot of cool things in this game that make it awesome. But anyways, the first thing that we will be doing is going to the tower. We'll go there right now. Um, for any new players out there, this is actually the loading screen. Uh, I didn't know that at first. I thought I was, like, supposed to be doing something. Like, what am I supposed to be doing? I'm so confused. But no, this is the loading screen. And depending on where you're going, the, uh, loading screen actually changes. So, like, if you're going to Venus, it'll, like, take long- well, it won't take longer to get there, but the way you- leave actually changes so if you're going from earth to venus then like you'll just like fly off and then you'll go into warp speed but if you're going to like the tower which is right next to earth you get to go here so the first thing we're going to do is as soon as you land at the tower you're going to turn right and you're going to start running into this the hangar you're going to make your way down the hall take a right and there's your ship you'll be able to see your ship actually docking. And I just think that I just think that's really cool. So there's the first thing. As soon as you land, you want to head right into the uh, the ship tower, the hangar, I'm not sure what it's called, let me see. Tower hangar, right? So when you first spawn, let me show you. It's Here's where you spawn, you're gonna take a right, and you're just gonna head right over there. So, head right over there. Enjoy Second thing is the bouncy ball. So, over here by the bounty bounty tracker, there's a bouncy ball. It's like a purplish, bluish, blackish color. And you can actually bounce it. Just to, like, bounce it everywhere. And it's kind of fun to just do stupid stuff with it. Alright, so the third thing is the D-pad. So, when you're at the tower, or actually anywhere for that matter, you can do this in the campaign too. On the D-pad, um, up is wave. So if you press up on the D-pad, you wave. If you press left on the D-pad, you point. So I can point to somebody. Let me see where a person is. I can point. Which is not showing up, but... There we go, see? If you press down on the D-pad, that sits. And if you press right on the D-pad, you dance. And the cool thing about Message dancing is that each person Water. has their own dance moves. And then like the robots, they uh, they do like the robot and she left. Okay. <laughs> but yeah. Alright, so the fourth thing is by the postmaster you can actually get on top. Right There's now. a cool little way to get on top. Um, it's not over here. Like you can't get on top of these boxes and jump up because like you'll hit your head and then you'll bounce away. So, you get up there <coughs> by 
Check going to the postmaster to where it says the postmaster and you have the stairs you have the stairs to the vanguard down there but what you do is you go up here to these stairs and you're going to line up your shot right in the middle of those two stacks of um, barrels okay so you're gonna come come back here you're gonna sprint and then as like a, the very last second you're gonna jump and you can get on top of here all right so I'll do it again you want to go all the way back here and then at the very last second like when you're like right here you're going to want to just jump you gotta you gotta be sprinting too so you sprint jump and you should make it um I don't know if, if it really matters yeah it, I think to me it helps if you hold down the jump button I don't know it just helps so yeah now the uh, I can't remember if that was the fifth or sixth I'm going with fifth. If you have in your inventory, this is uh, like a tip, not really a trick or anything. If you have in your inventory, um, crap, where are they? If you have in your toy something called an engram, so not sure where those engrams are, but if you have in your inventory and something called an engram and it's usually green you want to go over here called the cryptarch and what you do is you go to the cryptarch all right let's get started and here you have an engram okay and you press decode and then it uh, the cryptarch decodes it for nothing it's free and uh, it gives you open know what you're aiming at okay also you can buy stuff you can buy engrams uh, you can buy leg armor, helmet, body armor, everything. Be safe. But always pay attention to those little green exclamation points because that gives you good stuff. Um, also, if you get something called a crucible invitation, that lets you play multiplayer. So, what do you do with the engrams? You go to your carriage menu, you press start, options if you're on PS4. And then here's your stuff so here's on my guns and I'm holding R2 to compare and you always want to be holding R2 to compare because it tells you if it's better or not so I got that new sniper rifle and as you can see it's pretty freaking awesome so I'm going to equip that it does 111 damage um, kills with this weapon reduce the cooldown time of your grenade it's pretty sick. Alright, so what do you do with all these extra weapons? If you hold square, you can get Glimmer. And Glimmer is this, and you can use it to purchase new guns, engrams, armor, everything. So if you have a crappy weapon, just hold down square. It gets rid of it. It gives you weapon parts. Sometimes. But as you can see, I got 14 Glimmer. And I'm just going to do this on all my uh, guns that I don't need. You can also do it on armor too. But yeah, there you go some tips and tricks for destiny um, another tip and trick you can't go down here <laughs> I've already tried and this is what happens oh yeah you also can't land on the ship by the way because if you try to land on the ship you just go right through it and you fall to your death <laughs> so yeah Wee. So yeah, hope you enjoyed this video, leave a like if you did, 
I um, might be posting some more secret pawn shows and COD later. Um, follow my Twitter at um, official hg01. It's the it's my Twitter for Haysack Gaming 01. I'm posting uh, updates, what I'll be posting later, when something got posted, and more. Anyways, for like the tenth time in a row, hope you enjoyed this video. Leave a like if you did, subscribe, check out my Twitter, and check out my live stream account. See you later guys.